Basketball isn't easy. All my life, I've been striving to make myself better. Welcome, basketball fans, to 2K Sports. I'm Damon Bruce. Sunday in the NBA. And welcome, everyone, to another presentation. A quick check now at the starting five for both teams. And for the home team... Number four. Great look, but off the mark. Well, that defense went from poor to no defense at all. Well, you don't see him miss that shot very often. When he's open like that, it's usually lights out. Broke out the finger roll, guys. That was kind of a stylish finish. Passes to Holt. From beyond the arc, the shot no good. And here comes the break. Number 24. Oh, and that one. No question. Powered it down. Boy, oh boy, to be young again. My <laughs> old mind. Is that me thinking back to my days? Oh, yeah, right. It does make you nostalgia, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> yep. Reminds me a lot of myself in my younger days, too, guys. I, oh, wait. Maybe not. <laughs> <laughs> Let's send it over to Doris Burke, who caught up with head coach Mike Goodman's of course. Job one for them tonight, Kevin, getting back quickly on the defensive end of the floor. The real challenge when facing this team is limiting their transition points, and that, in no uncertain terms, is what he told his players going into this one. Guys? And thank you, Doris. The first bucket for this offense, one of four to start the game. Ball stolen. Number four. And that one's good. Heads up play on both ends there. Transition basketball, the steal and the quick push. Steve, that's how it should be played. I mean, rapid fire basketball. I like the call. I thought the defense was moving there. Yeah, I think he slid underneath. Good blocking call that trip. Number 24, defended by Holt. Number 24. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. First one falls for him. He hits both from the strike. Gone 0-3 from three-point land. Nothing yet going outside. Number four. Drains it from beyond the arc. He has five. That is not enough coverage. Got to do better than that defensively. Basically, no coverage. I mean, defense did not look very good there. Number seven. Second chance shot. It's rebounded by Holt. Well defended. And he's not someone who responds well to that kind of defensive pressure. Gone three of five, shooting the ball so far. Number six, the finger will finish at the back. And just under two and a half minutes elapsed here in the first. Number 32, that's good from 17 feet away. Very well done. He is a confident, dynamic scorer. Gotten four of six field goal attempts to drop in the first quarter. Second foul of the first quarter. They're probably going to have to sit him down here to try to avoid number three. Number 
for six. He's covered by Thompson. Play. We're about three minutes in. And the rejection by Aguiar. They retain possession. Number 32. And the go-ahead bucket, no good. Being well right out of the gates here at around 50%. Number seven. Off target with the open look. I tell you what, the mid-range shot is not the easiest one to make, but when you've got daylight like, like he had there, I mean, those are shots you want to make. There's the dish to Gray. Number four. Here it from three-point range. He's got eight. That shot becomes effortless for him when the D is so relaxed. They've got to get more intense. And here in the first quarter, with a little over three and a half minutes played, Number six, he's covered by Thompson. Rocket six, number 24. And there's a nice one-handed slam. Right back to the basics there, using the one-hand slam for that. Doesn't he make the basics a pretty exceptional? Yeah, he does. They look sweet when he does it. Well, he should stay with those basics in a tight ball game because we've got one here tonight. Picked away. He's all alone. Number six. Drops in the breakaway lane. That was the third straight high percentage look this defense has allowed. I mean, these defenders have got to start bumping bodies in the paint. Be more physical. Be more aggressive. I agree, Clark, but it doesn't look like they have the will to do that at this point. Thompson misses. You know, they've been beating this club to a lot of loose balls and rebounds here early on. Love the work ethic they've come out of the locker room with. Inside, number seven. Marvelous lead bounce, and he throws it down. Stupendous rush to the rim and a mighty slam on the end of it. But through the teeth of some pretty soft D, I can't help but say that. Well, let's see how that impacts things here, because those kinds of plays sometimes can be game changers on both sides. Yeah, when he's not blocking shots, he's altering them, Kevin, because he's just a constant presence and a threat defensively in the paint. And something else everybody loves about him is his ability to do the sensational and spectacular. His dunks simply defy description at times. So he can't get either to fall. Gone 7 of 12 from the field here in the first quarter. Number 24. He's covered by Thompson. Six to shoot. Pass to Castro. There's the three. That is good. He has five. How about the passing? They are moving the ball without any thought, without any agenda. It's hard to overstate all the points they've scored on assist today. Beautiful to watch. Gone five of 12 from the field since the opening tip. They get it. Offensive rebound. Number 32. And two free throws coming up as he misses that one. Drawing the whistle and a lot of contact there. Great job. Take it right at the defense. I like the aggressiveness. Yeah, he left them no choice but to foul there. And the first one drops. And that's good as he hits both of his shots. There's not a lot you can say that hasn't been said before about his skill at the charity strike. Gotten eight of the 13 shots to find the bottom of the bucket. Here's Castro. Gets blocked. Here's Gray. He's been patient so far. Nothing yet on the scoreboard. Number 24, lays it up and brings it in. And now we can see them really working it inside. Well, taking advantage of the defense, really pounding it down low. 
Number four, defended by Castro. Number four, can't hit the putback. In an impressive 60% early. The first free throw is good. Both free throws good from Castro. 36% in this first quarter trying to get their bearings. Back to Thompson. Number four. Drops in the tray. He's got 11. I'm not sure who was supposed to pick him up, but somebody's going to get an earful from the coach for leaving him that wide open. Number 50. And right away, they match it with a three-pointer of their own. Wow, just a tremendous first quarter shooting the basketball for them, guys. Yeah, when they put it up, it's gone in. Drills the three-pointer. What a quarter for him at the offensive end. He's ignored the scoreboard and continued to go out there and do his thing. Uses the glass to finish the lane. Boy, this defense is getting eaten up on the inside, guys. Giving up far too many free runs to the rim. And they haven't been able to return the favor. I mean, their offense in the paint has not been up to par. Number 32. The feather touch on the finger roll. Beautiful. He's got eight. Good defense, but you gotta love the finish with the finger roll over the top. Down low. Number seven. Makes it off the glass. Their prowess inside has been tremendous, guys. I mean, it's been no contest down on the low block. And until they prove they can stop them, I mean, they ought to continue to pound it in low. Back to Thompson. Number 32. And that's off the glass and in. Well, his scoring this quarter has been off the charts. And the complexion of the game as a result uh, may change. There's the pass to Castro. Number 50. And he's good on the free ball. Eight points for him. Thompson with it. Looking for his first basket still in this one. Now the feed to Gray. Number 32 battles through traffic and lays it in. Guys, he shot a very good percentage today, and they've needed it. Gone three of three from deep. Nine points rung up from outside here in the first. Number six. He's covered by Thompson. Number six. Smooth as silk on the finger roll. Boy, this game is off to a terrific start. No doubt, on both sides, high-octane offense. Yeah, he's seen enough of this interior scoring that his defense is giving up. So the message during this timeout is, you know, lock things up inside. You know, sometimes a group can just get spaced out on defense. They're not connected and playing five is one. And usually a timeout can help you refocus and recalibrate that defense. Good. And that makes six out of seven shooting the ball here. So he is off to a blazing start. Number 24. Time to finish it off. Oh, Maybe could have tried for a more memorable dunk than that. And we know he's capable of those memorable dunks. So you know, they've got a nice lead. Don't take any chances. The simple one-hander is just fine. That's good. He's got 17. 157 left to play in the first. Number 53. That's good. The number of points they've scored in the paint already today is pretty eye-opening, Steve. No, it's off the charts. It really is. And defensively, I mean, they have to start shutting down some of those lanes to the hoop. From deep. Can't get it to go. Zero. The stupendous finish in traffic. Really come together immediately, threatening to run away with this game. 
It's hard to imagine they'll be able to stay as hot as they've been so far, but if they can, watch out. To the paint, stolen by Thompson. He kicks to Gray. He dishes it to Thompson. Got a piece of it. Number 35. He's covered by Thompson. Zero. Can't hit it to fall. Thirty seconds left here in the opening quarter. He feeds it to Thompson. No good on the three. Well, that defense went from poor to no defense at all. Well, you don't see him miss that shot very often. When he's open like that, it's usually lights out. They keep going down low with the ball, and it results in points. They're having their way in the paint. And it's resulted in a big early lead, too. Three-pointer. But they'll get another chance. Number four. Hands it from downtown. 17 points in the game. A free-flowing first quarter. Great scoring through one. The home team. Welcome back, folks. We'll see if we're in store for a more tightly contested quarter as we move here into the second. And guys, what's your take on the home?